the difference between stocks and bonds, and what that difference means to you and your investment strategy. With stocks, you are actually buying into part ownership of a company, and in many cases, you actually get voting rights for that company. Whereas with bonds, you are becoming a creditor of that company who will be paid back at the end of the life of that particular bond you hold. So why would you invest in one as opposed to the other? Well, it depends a lot on two things, your investment goals and your basic nature. For instance, are you the sort of person who always prefers to be sure of the outcome? Or are you possibly a risk taker, even if it's, even if it's a calculated risk? With bonds, you are generally guaranteed a return on your money of say 5 to 7 or more percent. That is a fixed percentage annually for the life of the bond. With stocks and shares, there is no such guarantee. But it is highly likely that a combination of the interest return and capital gain you get from the stocks may put you way ahead of that which you get from bonds.